So I've got another flat tire on my bicycle. The rear tire there is flat. But uh, it's not from a puncture. Like you normally get a flat tire. This one, if you look right up inside here, maybe you can see that. It's right at the valve stem, which is kind of strange. But when I got this flat tire, I noticed that the valve stem was pointed forward the way it is now. And what's happening here is the tire itself is slipping on the rim as I pedal and it just pulls the it pulls the valve. It pulls that valve right off of the tube and uh, that's not really a place you can patch because you know it's in a corner. So I got some silicone and I'm going to try and silicone the, the tire right to the rim and see if maybe this tube lasts a little longer. This time around I even bought the heavy duty inner tube because I thought it might last longer. You see it's got a super thick sidewall compared to a regular uh, inner tube that you'd get for a bike tire. So my new tube is the same style that heavy duty supposedly puncture proof inner tube. We'll see if this one works out any better. Looks like we have another goofy problem in the meantime. As the belt keeps jumping off this compressor, but it looks like it's just the drive pulley has worked its way off. I'm going to move it back in and it'll probably track a little better if the two pulleys are in line. That looks a little better. Now I'm not using the silicone to seal in the air or anything, I just want something that's going to hold this rubber lip here against uh, the metal of the rim because uh, it just doesn't seem to be a perfect fit and it always slides one way or the other depending on whether I'm pedaling or, or braking and it's ripping the valve stem off.
So it looks like it's seated okay on both sides. I'll put it up to full pressure. There's 68, which is good enough for me. So with any luck, that silicone is going to hold the rubber of the tire to the metal rim, and uh, I won't be having any more flats for a while.